Hey guys, Felix here. Today I'm going to kind of do a kind of general discussion video. It's going to be another short video, but I keep getting asked on when I should be taking certain talents. Like people keep at coming to me and asking, hey man, uh, is Ring of Peace or Lake Street better? So I'm going to be talking today about why I choose certain things going up against certain comps or in random battlegrounds or in PvE. And I'm going to be kind of discussing my thought process when picking these talents, and then at the same time talking about what you guys should be thinking when you're picking these certain talents, because again, everyone's playstyle is different. So, again, I'm going to be talking about this. It's kind of be, going to be kind of like a general discussion video. So, hope this gives you guys some insight on why I choose these certain talents. Without further ado, guys, let's get started. Alright guys, so again, this is going to be a general discussion video. I'm not going to be reading a script, I'm just going to kind of generally talk about it to kind of give you guys a little bit of insight, and also talk about your point of view as well. So let's get started. So, when I decide to choose Ring of Peace over Leg Sweep, or vice versa, it kind of depends mainly, and it kind of really boils down to, okay, I go into a comp, say it's like a 2v2 arena, and I'm versing certain people like, let's say, uh, a druid, and or like a paladin. The paladin's a better example, like a paladin and a mage. Say it's a paladin and a mage. I kind of go in, I get into the arena room, and I'm thinking to myself, alright, it'd be great for the instant silence, but can I actually use Ring of Peace for its full duration? Meaning, especially in 5.4, if you guys are not on top of that person when you activate Ring of Peace, the first part of Ring of Peace won't work. So, you guys gotta keep that in mind. Ring of Peace is an amazing talent, but it really boils down to, okay, can I actually catch up to that person to use Ring of Peace to its full duration? Can I keep up with them, their kiting abilities? Can I get out of their roots? Do I do not want to manage my cooldowns effectively? It also comes down to the player. So, if you're a person that has trouble catching up to someone, like a certain class, let's say you got you have trouble keeping up with the druid and in 2v2s or 3v3s and you usually just want to be like, alright, I just want to go on the DPS, I can't catch up to this druid, he's kiting me for years, I can't catch up to him, so I need to switch on the DPS. If you want to use Ring of Peace for the healer, and that's the reason why you took it, make sure that you are comfortable with being able to stick on that target for the full duration of Ring of Peace so you can get it off to make it the most effective cooldown as possible. First thing, Leg Sweep. Leg Sweep is a really good choice and a talent. I do like Ring of Peace, but again, even myself, it boils down to, all right, can I catch up to that person? Can I actually use Ring of Peace to its full duration? And then that's basically when I draw my line, saying in the beginning of the match, all right, do I want to take Ring of Peace or do I want to take Leg Sweep? Again, guys, Leg Sweep is an amazing talent. The only thing that I really don't like about it is it shares a DR with your Fist of Fury stun, as well as other stuns that, depending on who you're running with, like if you're running with um, a Hunter Web Wrap stun, it'll be DR'd. Um, so you're, you already got a lot of stuff DRing already, so that also comes into, into play. So if you're running like 3v3s and you have a lot of people on your team that have stuns, like say you're running with a Warrior and you have Shockwave, I mean, War is not really the best example. Alright, so let's say a Feral Druid. Okay, so Feral Druids have Maim, they got Bash, they got all that stuff. So say you're running with like a Feral Druid or a Rogue with like kidney shots and stuff. I wouldn't suggest running with a Rogue as a Monk because DR is for days, but this is just an example. So say you're running with them, and they got a lot of CC that DRs with yours. Um, you would want to take Ring of Peace regardless because you already have X amount of CC that DRs are ready, so you want to take something, I mean even if you have trouble catching up, you still want to take something that works and doesn't DR easily. So again guys, that's basically the thought process that I go through when I'm choosing Ring of Peace versus Leg Sweep. Again, it depends on your playstyle as well, depending if you guys have any trouble catching up to someone. So guys, I urge you guys to just kind of toy with it a little bit, check it out, kind of notice yourself. Alright, I have a lot of trouble catching up to Paladins. I think any monk has trouble catching up to Paladins. Paladins are monk's worst nightmare. 
um, because they got movement speed increases and they got a lot of freedoms and they're just they're just annoying. They're just not our friend um, to DPS down. But guys, just kind of toy around with it a little bit. I mean, this has just been a kind of short video, but I hope it gave you guys some insight on why I choose these talents. Hope this helped, guys, and hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care and have a wonderful day. I'll tell you what I tell you.